So this is Family Guy in Call of Duty Zombies. We're playing as Peter Griffin right now. That is hilarious. And it looks like uh, our best friend hates us. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Why'd you make me do that, buddy? Now the chicken right there makes total sense. We've always had beef with the chicken. So yeah, we'll just, we'll just clear. Ouch. Come on, Brian. Uh, I was going to say, let's just clear this uh, wave one of zombies out. And it seems like it's a super expensive map. Look at this crap. 2000 for the first door. It won't let us through the front door. But yeah, I think this is going to be a super funny map. Uh, if you do end up enjoying it, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Also, leave a like. And I guess if you don't enjoy the video, you can go ahead and leave a dislike. I would really appreciate it. My goodness. Oh, no. I mean, it's not like super hard yet, but it's, it's kind of hard to tell... Like, their hitboxes seem... I don't know. They're probably normal, but their character models are kind of big. So, I can't tell how close I can get to them to actually knife them. But I actually had to load in this Peter Griffin player model separately. The mod creator actually only had us spawning in as Rick Toffin. So, <laughs> I thought it'd be funnier if we could actually see Peter Griffin's hand. And look at this crap. You can actually see his belly when he slides. That is so funny. Uh, let's see. Should we get the Olympia or we're not getting the Olympia? Okay. Uh, that wasn't even funny. It, it, we're just not getting it. Yeah, we'll be able to... Urgh! Like, I don't even hear him, bro. I don't have the sound effect volume up super high, but like, I figured I'd still be able to hear him a little bit. Like, come on, man. Yeah, you can't, you can't hear him running at you at all. Like, I obviously have the sound effects on. You can hear me knifing him. What the heck is going on right now? But yeah, guys, we just hit 1,000 subscribers, quadruple digits. What? Yeah, I really appreciate everybody who stuck around. I've actually been on YouTube for like two years, and I'm just super excited right now. I thought I might as well play my favorite TV show on my fa one of my favorite games. I, I don't know. I'd probably say this is my favorite game. Like, I, I haven't really got bored with it. I've been doing the zombie stuff for like almost a whole year consistently making videos and i haven't really got bored of it but yeah this is not the thousand subscriber special or anything uh, i just figure this would be a shorter video and i can kind of talk about what i'm gonna do for the thousand subscribers it's gonna sound so much better after i edit this video right now there's like no music whatsoever i actually had to turn it off because uh, there's a lot of copyright stuff and there's still is a bunch of copyright stuff right now. Uh, hopefully the music I add post editing is going to make it sound a lot better. Let me get our quick revive real quick. Let's quickly get the quick revive. <laughs> but yeah, I don't have like a specific video idea just yet. I have a couple things in mind, but I do want to do some kind of Q&A. I know that's like what every single YouTuber does. But that's kind of the reason I want to do it. I've always wanted to do one of those. I don't know. I figured some of y'all would actually want to know a little bit more about me. Y'all can ask specific questions. I don't even care how many questions you leave. Uh, just leave it in the comment of this video. Uh, by the way, the first step to the Easter egg, you have to knife the teddy bear. And that actually opens up the front door. But yeah, leave as many questions as you want. Like, it doesn't even have to be a serious question. It can be something funny. It might give people a good laugh. Or if you have like a serious question, I'll definitely uh, seriously answer it. I'm just going to kill him. We don't have any points to do anything. Because look at this. 1250. But okay. So that house is tiny. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we're just going to stay out here. We're not going to worry about going up there. I, I don't know how we're going to figure stuff out because... There's no room to, like, run past zombies inside. I don't freaking know, man. Or I guess there's no room to run past a chicken and a dog. <laughs> ah, if I can get Jug or something, that'd be super nice. Yeah, stamina up would be nice, too. I feel like I'm running kind of slow. It's like the zombies are just as fast as me. Or may maybe they're a tiny bit slower. Because I think if I walk, they can't catch up to me. But if I stop for, like, a second, they're going to catch up. Oh my gosh. Yeah, and and Brian is shorter than the chicken. So there's like it's like we're going against Nova Crawlers on uh Keynote or Toten, and then the regular zombies are the chickens. But yeah, about the thousand subscriber video. It might be the video directly after this one. I'm not sure. 
Uh, it, it's going to be, like I said, the Q&A. And I don't know. It might just be a pretty simple video. I don't want it to be like crazy long or anything. I want people to be able to stick around and actually hear their question. <laughs> okay, it's getting kind of hard to like do anything. Like I'm trying to figure out. Like luckily I bought the right door. I only bought that door because it seemed to be the most expensive. And in the map notes, it said something about a bunch of stuff is down in the garage. So I kind of just assumed it was this one or the basement. Maybe not the garage. I think we can, yeah, knife that. I don't know what the heck that's going to do. Two keys required. Oh, okay. Now that's the garage. Okay. So yeah, we had the basement and then the actual garage. But yeah, I guess there's not really much else to say about the Q&A. Just make sure to leave your question down in the comments section. Or I'm also probably going to make a community post. So there'll be like two different uh, sections for questions. Because I know not everybody's going to watch a Family Guy Zombies video. What the heck? So we, we haven't got a drop in forever, but you're going to drop every drop for us. Okay, nice. Well, it, it's finished. I guess we will grab this nuke, though. I'll turn the power on. Where's the power? Oh, crap. The power was down here. I need to get the heck... Ah, power lag. I need to get out of here, bro. I do not want to get trapped. But yeah, I really do appreciate everybody that's been sticking around. <laughs> uh, I know. I feel like I've already said that, but uh, I don't know. I'm just super excited right now. I was about to go to the gym, but then I opened up my phone and it said 1,000. I was like, what, bro? I got to make a at least some kind of video real quick because it's kind of weird. Sometimes... I just don't have the mental energy to record a video. And I don't know. It kind of sucks. Oh, my gosh. Those are like teleporters. I don't want to jump in the teleporter. I forget which one goes where, but I've seen some in the back. I don't want to get randomly teleported to the back. Or if one of these spawn inside, then I'm kind of screwed. So I don't really want to get spawned inside. That would suck a, a bunch of balls. Oh, I didn't mean to finish the round, man. Ah, you know what? Let's go in here. We'll grab that juggernaug. Uh, what do we have here? The bulldog? Bro, I need a better weapon. I've just been using this PDW, and it's not even the good PDW from Black Ops 2. I don't even know what this is from. It feels like a advanced warfare weapon, but I'm not sure. I mean, oh my gosh. See, this is exactly what I didn't want to happen. Oh my gosh. Really? We got to be careful. I wish there was a... Urgh! Ah! Ah! Oh my gosh, that was so close. Oh my gosh! Ah! Oh my gosh! Okay, well that actually worked out. Oh my gosh, we're dead, bro. What is up with these teleporters? Bro, what... Dude, really? Really? Why were that? There was no way out for me, bro. So I really did not feel like redoing that entire intro. That was like the dumbest down ever, bro. But I do have a crap ton of points now. Uh, why did I come up here? Oh my gosh. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I meant to come over here and do exactly what we did last time. <laughs> There's like no way to get out of there once you go up the stairs. And I just turned the power on, which is probably going to screw me over. But... We'll knife that, and then hopefully I can get Jug. Oh, man, this is scary. Let me out, let me out, let me out. Yeah, these uh, teleporters really screw you over, bro. It's kind of ridiculous. I wanted to save that zombie. Ah, that way I could, like, figure out exactly where all the teleporters spawn. Like, if I jump into that one, which one is it going to send me to? That would it'd help a little bit. That way I'm not completely confused on where I'm at. Because, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. It seems like one of them, like, I don't know if it's that one, but I swear one of them in the front yard just sends you to the other side of the front yard. Like, why would I want to do that? It's just going to get me trapped. But yeah, I come out here and they're like, it's like a wall of zombies. There was like no way. I guess if I was a little bit faster, but no, it's like, as soon as I figured out, I should just run in between two zombies. They all closed in on me. <laughs> I really need a crawler right now. Oh my gosh. That looks freaking creepy. But he's like in the ground. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna... Oh my god. See? That's so dumb. Okay, so this one... 
Let's see where this one gives us. It, it puts us over here. And then where's this one throw us? On the other side. I wish there was a way to turn off the teleporters. They're so annoying. Okay, where does this one spawn us? Over here too? What? So that one spawns us right there. And that one also spawns us right there. What? This is so confusing. Oh my gosh. It's completely random, bro. Oh, that is ridiculous. This one, 100% just spawned me right there. Let's wait for it to cool down. And yep, it's completely random. Oh my gosh. It is super annoying that there's freaking teleporters at all. But now knowing that they just send you random places, that's even worse, bro. Okay, we come over here. That opened up something. Where did that open? It opened nothing. Or at least it, it didn't open anything that we can see. We probably have to open up another door for it to open. Oh, look, the tail. The tail of the chicken. Double points. Let's let's spend 2,000 to get double points. That seems like a waste. I don't, I don't know which one to like open up, bro. So yeah, while we're waiting for this guy to come outside, uh, let me... Oh my gosh. That was... The, the, I'm still so annoyed. But yeah, let me know what your favorite TV show is. I'd say Family Guy is definitely up there. I, I feel like it's one of them shows that you can just put on in the background. Or if you don't have that long, you can pretty much put on any episode. Oh, okay. We, it opened this door. Nice. I didn't think I'd find it so fast. A reward awaits you in the spawn. Okay. Okay. We got a key. Oh my gosh. He's, he's getting faster. Okay, we actually have to go through all these teleporters in a specific order. It, he even said that this part is super annoying. Uh, <laughs> I don't know why he would make this step if he thinks it's annoying. But, I mean, at least he's honest. Yeah, we actually have to go through in a specific order. And we'll hear some kind of chime. Or some kind of sound effect that'll notify us that it was the correct teleporter. Okay, so the map creator was not lying. This is pretty annoying. But I at least figured out the different sound effects. So I kind of have an idea of what the heck I'm doing. This is the first one for sure. And then the second one, we got to run all the way around. And it's going to be this one right here. I think the next one, I mean, it could either be that one or I'm going to try this one next. Okay, I have three of them down. So it's either that one or this one. I'm just going to go with this one. Oh, bro, we did it. This is the last one. Oh, a reward, a reward awaits you at spawn. <laughs> I can't even talk. Yeah, boy. So that's two keys. And oh, yeah, yeah, down in the basement, there's a door that has two keys. Open door. Um, Hello? What the? Oh, bro, we're at the... Uh... Crap, what is this place called? It's like the clam or something. We can pack a punch. Do I really want to pack a punch this though? Oh, buy a random perk for 2,500 points. I kind of want to get other perks first. Uh, I want to get like a guaranteed double tap. Yeah, we'll pack a punch the MP5. Screw it. Oh, bro, look at that. That was funny. Ooh. I mean, this is just like the basic camo, but I think it looks really nice with the, the way this map like I said earlier in the video, or at least I think I said it earlier. Crap, we could have got the hammer, I guess. But yeah, the, the graphics look very similar to Borderlands. So it kind of just makes this camo pop a little more. I don't know where Brian went. Maybe he's right. Yep, right there. Okay, so apparently there was some kind of Bible ending at the bar that I just overlooked. So I'm not sure what the Bible ending is going to cost. We'll go back at the end of this round. If we survive, I mean, <laughs> these teleporters are probably going to screw me over. Yeah, I don't know if 2500 per perk is even worth it. I feel like we should definitely buy the cheaper perks first, like Deadshot, Double Tap, and Stamina Up. That way, when we buy the 2500 perks, then it'll kind of be worth it. Because if I pay 2500 and get Deadshot, I'm, I'm going to be kind of annoyed. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Oh, double max ammo. So pointless, but whatever. So yeah, let me go over here. By our double tap root beer. Oh my gosh, he's so fast. I got kind of used to there being a crawler. So that's exactly what we're about to do again. Oh, I killed him, dang it. You know what? We're just going to go check real quick. Okay, is this where it is? 
75,000. Oh my gosh. Oh, we can double pap if we want, but we can't actually. Don't have enough. Yeah, I guess we'll slowly build our points. We'll get all the freaking perks. I assume there's not going to be a perk limit. That would be super annoying. I might as well get stamina up next just in case there is a four perk limit. But then we'll buy the cheap dead shot. And then hopefully there's like Widow's Wine and all the, all the cool perks, you know. Maybe some custom perks. Yeah, I don't know why people in the comments are saying that this is like a terrible map. I mean, it's not like overly great or anything, but I don't have a problem with it so far. Besides the teleporters, I haven't seemed to run into any glitches or anything. Uh, crap. Oh my gosh. The dude is so fast. Oh, we got electric cherry. I mean, I guess we'll grab it. I don't know exactly where stamina up is. Oh yeah, it's right here. I knew I seen it. Stamina up might actually come in clutch because there's so many times where I'm trying to get through the zombies, but I don't want to run into the teleporter. So stamina up should help us. Okay, I'll grab my dead shot. And what other perks we have? We have so many doors we haven't opened yet. Uh, 1,500. Oh, mule kick. Ew. I do not want mule kick. Bro, we need to make this guy a crawler. He's going to kill us. Oh, yes. We got a crawler. Okay. We'll, we'll uh, open up all the doors up top first. Yeah, we got Chris's room. That is awesome. The bow 27. Oh, we got speed cola right there. And yeah, this one was Meg's room. And I assume this is going to be the bathroom. Crap. We don't have enough. Ah, I didn't want to kill him. I thought I'd be able to get a couple shots off. Whatever. Yeah, it's the bathroom. Toilet lottery. Oh, bro. I kind of want to see what that is. I mean, it shows a monkey bomb, but I don't know. It, it Toilet lottery sounds like it's going to be something random. Dang, bro. We actually have so many points to go. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I feel like the Peter Griffin model definitely goes super well with this map. I don't know how hard it would be for the mod creator to add that, but he could probably just ask the other mod creator if he could use the Peter Griffin model. I don't I don't know if they'd be cool with that, but I don't know. He could ask. It doesn't hurt to ask. Okay, you know what? We'll grab this. That way I can search the rest of the house real quick. Oh, yeah, yeah. I wanted to try this out. Oh, it's the mystery box, bro. That that totally makes sense. 950. Come on, give me something good. Okay, that is not good, but whatever. Okay, let's see what perk we get. Oh, we got Widow's Wine. Nice. Ew, Meal Kick. Speed Cola. You can't buy any more perks. Okay, so we got a Perkaholic. Let's get out of here. I guess I will open this door. Oh, okay, okay. I totally forgot about the zombie shield. That'll be nice. Because we already picked up the part. It was like right there. Uh, Where do you build it? Oh, right here. Let's go. I guess we'll buy whatever this door is. Okay, so we have a little bank system. Deposit a thousand and then withdraw. Nice, nice. Ah, uh, he, he died by the widow's wine. And we only have one more door to buy. And then we pretty much have everything. I don't really care to open this door. Oh, man, we don't have like any ammo in our good weapon. And the spaz. I mean, I guess it's a one shot, but we're not going to give very many points for this. Yeah, I think I'm doing a little better at avoiding these little teleporters. It's just as soon as they came in, like... <laughs> I was just getting spawned in random places. And was the final room. Oh, what the? Pick up the Mark II ray gun for 2,500? Uh, sure. <laughs> I did not expect that. That is awesome. Oh, yeah, we have Mule Kick. I forgot about that. So we still have the Spaz. Ah, I can't make a crawler now. Okay, so I have a couple weapons to choose from. The Bow 27. That's the Advanced Warfare weapon. I could get the LSAT. We probably would never run out of ammo. You know what? We'll, we'll grab the LSAT. We'll use up all its ammo, and then I guess I'll go pack a punch it. But, bro, we still have pretty much all 75,000 to get. Ah! Uh, yeah, I'm not going to lie. I'm getting a, a little bored. <laughs> this map, like, at first it was kind of difficult, but now it's, like, super easy. I wish there was, like, some kind of boss round or something. That would make this a little better. I do want to try to get another random weapon out of the box. I don't really see anything too crazy in here, though. Uh, that's kind of crazy. What is this? I did get rid of my Pack-a-Punch MP5 just because I, I don't really care for it. Oh, what the? What the heck? This is like a... Oh, my gosh. That could have killed me. Yeah, this is like an explosive weapon. Oh, it's like a... Oh, no! Okay, as soon as I start goofing off, I almost die. <laughs> 
It's like another type of war machine, but I think it's from Advanced Warfare. It doesn't seem to be good at all, so. <laughs> yeah, I didn't really see anything too crazy in the box. I might just get the BAL 27. Yeah, get rid of this crap. Where is that BAL? Oh, it's right here. It's right here. Yeah, wasn't this like one of the best weapons in Advanced Warfare? The name sounds super familiar. Oh, yeah, that is that is satisfying. Oh, and I didn't really play Advanced Warfare too much. I probably played it pretty consistent for like the first two months of it, but then I just completely dropped it. I don't even know why. I think I just got super busy. That was, I was probably like 15 when it came out. So busy with school. Oh, bro, we're so close. No, no. Ah, I was trying to make good use of that double points. Excuse me, zombies. <laughs> oh, bro. Yeah, we're almost at 75K. I've literally just been running around in circles for like 10 minutes. I don't know why they had to put 75,000 for the Bible ending. It makes sense for some maps, but I, I don't know. We were done with like the, the Easter egg slash Pack-a-Punch quest like super early, probably like round 15 or something. And then I had like no points because it's such a low round. And then you're like 75,000, just kill a bunch of zombies. I mean, I guess some people really enjoy just running around in circles. I mean, I, I do a little bit, but I, I'm mainly for like doing challenges or do like a Easter egg quest or something. But I don't know. It's, it's whatever, man. Uh, but I think that's about it. There was like a, a free perk Easter egg, but I actually went ahead and wait, what? You can open up the garage? I did not know that. I thought it was just opening up that door. Okay, that's kind of cool. But yeah, there was some kind of perk Easter egg, but... Uh, I went ahead and bought all the perks before I even knew about that. So it's kind of pointless. You just go around and interact with like five different picture frames. But but yeah, look at this. In the game. Yeah, thank you for playing. You have escaped. You survived 26 rounds. Ah, oh, bro, look at our headshot. 669. Oh, yeah. What the heck, Brian? W what's wrong? <laughs> and he died. But yeah, guys, that's going to do it for this video. Hopefully everybody did enjoy. If you did, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Also, leave a like. And I guess if you didn't like the video, leave a dislike. But yeah, thank you all for a thousand subscribers. I'm going to get to work on that thousand subscriber special. I really do appreciate every single one of y'all. But yeah, with all that said, hopefully everybody has a fantastic day. And I'll see y'all in the next one.